Hope Finley City Schools. I want to reach out to you today and give you an update. Um, our legislators um, met yesterday. They passed legislation um, regarding the COVID-19 um, ended testing requirements for this year. No third grade reading guarantee, no end of course exams. Um, we're working through that whole process. Um, and we'll continue to communicate with you on that. I want to let you know that I'm blown away uh, with all the work that's going on to the REOs, how you've worked with the directors of instruction, how you've worked with your building principals and each other uh, to get information out to our students. We need to plan on continuing that uh, through the year. Our biggest fear is, number one, um, to make sure we're servicing our kids and getting services to them, getting food to them, um, students with mental health issues, making sure we're getting um, services to them through what we have in the community. And uh, as we move forward, we want to shorten the gap of instruction and what was lost this year through this uh, pandemic virus and get as much material covered as we possibly can so that when we do start up next year, um, it can be fluid and, and smooth um, for our students to move on. Um, graduation requirements um, will be uh, the credits um, to get 21 credits for Finley City Schools is what's needed to graduate. Um, we will work through that process and we will communicate that to our seniors, which the high school is working on right now. Um, blown away by what's going on with the community, how we pulled together in servicing our students and our families. I want to continue to do that. And then individually, you um, take care of yourself and your family. Uh, make sure you're abiding by the guidelines to control this virus and, and to keep it under control as much as we possibly can. Continue to communicate with us um, if there's things that you need. I will tell you, and moving forward, we kind of really took a step back this week of getting people away from facilities. Our essential personnel, um, we will have to work through your directors, uh, your supervisors, and your principals because we will have to take care of facilities. We will we'll have to do the things that we need to do uh, that essential personnel will need to do in the spring to maintain, uh, and we'll communicate with you on that. Uh, again, take care, stay safe, and go Trojans. Thank you.